Citing the resurgent threat of the coronavirus pandemic in many parts of California, Governor Gavin Newsom announced Friday, July 17, that California schools will start the new school year with many students once again learning from home. We all prefer in-person classroom education, but only if it's safe, Newsom said during his daily news conference. Safety is foundational. And safety ultimately makes the determination about how we go about educating our kids. Students who live in the more than 30 counties where the coronavirus is again spreading rapidly are affected by Friday's order. Those counties include Los Angeles, Orange, Riverside and San Bernardino counties, all of which have set records for infections, daily deaths or both in recent weeks. The directive applies to public and private schools, the governor said. In all, a majority of California's six. One million public school students will begin the new school year as the last one ended, learning online at home. Learning is non-negotiable, Newsom said. Schools must, and I underscore, must, provide meaningful instruction whether they are open or not. Schools could reopen normally during the new school year, if the counties in which they're located get the viruses spread under control. If a county's coronavirus infection rates go down for 14 days in a row and the county otherwise meets California Department of Public Health criteria, it can be removed from the state watch list and be eligible to reopen its schools. Even then, the decision to reopen schools normally would be up to local officials. Southern California counties are a long way from that point, though, with Los Angeles, Orange, Riverside and San Bernardino counties repeatedly making and breaking records for most single-day infections and deaths over the summer. Elementary schools can also reopen with a waiver from the county health officer, if the waiver is requested by a school district superintendent with the support of employees, district families and community groups. Friday's announcement wasn't a surprise. On July 1, Newsom had ordered 19 counties, including Los Angeles, Orange, Riverside and San Bernardino, with rapidly increasing coronavirus infections to close bars and the indoor operations of restaurants, wineries, zoos and entertainment venues like bowling alleys and miniature golf. On Monday, July 13, he had doubled down, putting additional restrictions on 30 counties, including the four, with rising infection numbers. Newsom also ordered churches and temples, gyms, hair salons, malls and offices for non-essential businesses to close their doors. As of Friday, a total of 32 counties are on the monitoring list, and Newsom said two or three more are close to being added to it. Even in counties not affected by the governor's distance learning orders, school will look different as the 2020-21 school year starts. Students in third grade and up would be required to wear masks, along with all staff.